Hello, everyone. Today, I have a unique to me build, mostly because this is a build that you will not find on the gallery. I apologize for that, but it is what it is. I recorded this build probably sometime in 2022. Um, whenever the Spa Day Refresh came out, it was shortly after that. Because um, that's when I bought it. So I'm building a spa. <laughs> and I thought I had built this for a legacy game that I was playing. And it was, you know, my first legacy game. And I must have deleted it without uploading it to the gallery or the gallery deleted it. You know that happens. Uh, something happened to make it disappear. <laughs> and yeah, so I'm going to look through some more files. I've I looked through a couple. And just to double check, because sometimes I'll copy them to another world or another save file. Um, just, you know, because I've used them in a different build or in a different world or a different save. And see if I can find anything. I do have quite a few of my old saves backed up. Um, I just have to go through them. But uh, I'll say right now it's not looking good that I'm going to find it. The good news... If you guys would like me to redo this build and have it available on the gallery, please let me know in the comments below because I will take the time to do it. Um, hopefully, I'll have time fairly quickly after this video goes live to do that. It is a simple build, so it wouldn't take me very long to redo it because I, I have what I need to look at to see where things are. Um, I'll just have to do some screenshots of the video. But in general, it wouldn't take too long to do. So I'm very open to doing that if it's something you want to download and use. So if not, and I don't get any comments, um, I might redo it eventually. Um, I might just build a new one. <laughs> so, you know, I, I could do for another spa. And uh, I've, my build skills have improved quite a bit since I built this. So I do have to say, this is a good build. I played in this build. Um, as I said, this is at the time where I was building for my games and so I used all of my builds and this one was one I used and I I did I did like playing in it that's why I'm surprised I don't like it's not it's not my library it's it's nowhere to be found so I know I had some problems with things disappearing at one point and that could be the problem too so Anyway, let me uh, get into this build a little bit from what I remember. Uh, with this one, I did want to stick with like an island vibe, but a little more modern. Um, maybe it's one of these new builds that, you know, is trying to mimic the buildings around it, but in a modern twist. So that's kind of where this, this build is going. Now, that being said, I also wanted to keep it light and airy, uh, at least feeling-wise. This does have a lot of windows. I didn't put in um, the open doorways or any of that into this. And a lot of that is because, you know, the island still gets cold and your sims complain. And I don't know, I, I just didn't do it. But it's also very easy to translate into another world by just changing, you know, some of the outside features uh, and, and a couple of the windows. <laughs> so, so this could go into any world, really, well, if I got it, you know, rebuilt. Um, but I built it for island living. So here I'm working on some outside areas because, again, it's an island. We need the outside areas. 
And I didn't want to do a ton. Like, I didn't want the whole thing to be outside. But I did want some of it to be outside. So here you can see I'm trying to figure out the spa area and bathrooms and just the general layout of the inside. I wanted this to have kind of a cozy vibe, but not too cozy, okay? It's a spa, you wanna keep it clean, um, but not hospital-like, okay? <laughs> so, so that was my, my end goal with that. And again, I think I've pulled it off pretty well. I created some, you know, kind of spaces that made sense these little like this little area here um, created an area for the lockers here and again it just you know it makes sense and moving on to the small little area to get a manicure or pedicure uh, again I didn't want to go too crazy with things in here I wanted it to be kind of a small, cozy, you know, spa that, you know, a local resident runs. Not, you know, anything too crazy. Um, I am debating about doing a modern spa. So if that's something you want to see, I, I might be up for that. I haven't played with Spa Day in a while. And I think some of that is because I don't think a lot of people own it. Um, I like it, actually. It, it's good gameplay for, like, prom... Um, it's good game play for weddings. So, yeah. I also don't tend to go to a spa often. I think I've been twice in my life to an actual spa. Um, like, I've had, I get my nails done every once in a while. My, or pedicure done. I don't do my nails. Um, mine are usually in pretty good shape. They're not very great right now as I'm looking at them going, eh, I need to do something. But I don't like to get my nails done because I type a lot. Um, not just with work, but I have been a blogger slash writer uh, for about 20 years now. And I do still do quite a bit of that. So my nails need to be uh, able to type. So anyway, back to this build. <laughs> So here, just putting in the, you know, getting in the sunroof, ah, sunroofs, the uh, glass roofs figured out a little bit better. Again, you know, keeping that kind of island vibe to the roof area. And then here are the massage tables. I wanted those to be outside for sure. And then I like the little like sun deck area. You can go and just kind of relax and have your facial on or whatever. And, you know, when I played this, that's exactly what they did. So it was really cool that that kind of worked the way I, I pictured that. Um, so I'll be honest. I mean, other than kind of your basic stuff, I don't remember a lot about my thought process <laughs> with this belt. And, I mean, that makes sense. It was quite a while ago. Um, but... I know, I, I know the vibe just from looking at it that I was going for, which was very kind of an open, airy vibe without being an open concept. Um, so yeah, so that's kind of what I did there. Now, I do know for sure that I did tear down this at one point because I built a restaurant here uh, in that save file. So that's why I'm thinking I I might have deleted it and not realized it was on the gallery or something. Um, but yeah, I will say that restaurant ended up nice and open and airy. That is on the gallery um, in two versions. I don't I don't know if I have a video up for that. If I do, I don't have a voiceover for it. Um, and I don't know for sure if I recorded it or not. I might not have. That's that's my hesitation there. <laughs> But, yeah. Um, but anyway, back to this build. Uh, put in a cool little, like, meditation, guided meditation area. And now just kind of doing the finishing touches on these rooms and getting them to be, you know, a little more cozy feeling, but not 
too crazy. Again, we're looking at a, a you know, community type lot, business lot. I will say, I really am impressed with how well my build skills are there. They've quite improved. <laughs> but, you know, I, I don't think this looks too bad. I think, I think you know, I'd go to this spa. I would. Um, especially, you know, being, it would mean I'm at a tropical island somewhere. I mean, that right there. Yeah. So now just kind of finishing up a few other things outside. Making that a little more inviting. And then I'm going to start working on some landscaping here soon. And I'm going to admit my landscaping skills at this point were pretty dang good. I mean, I kind of hope they are. I, uh, I didn't take the landscaping class at my technology center in high school. I took the floral arranging class. However, um, the landscaping class happened at the same time and they were taught by the same teacher. So we were kind of left to our devices in the floral department. And, uh, so I got to hear all the landscaping stuff and, and help out. We went and helped them uh, a few times with some things. And so, you know, I, I do have an idea of how landscaping should look and, and be. So I'm not completely surprised, but I've definitely learned a few more tricks since doing this one. <laughs> all right. So... The other thing with this build is, as I said, I could probably easily redo it. The landscaping will probably look quite a bit different um, just because I don't know exactly what I use. I mean, the bigger stuff I could figure out, but some of the other, I'm not sure exactly what I used, but yeah. So again, just finishing touches, um, and I am actually going to stop talking here in a minute and let you guys finish out the video because I don't have pictures to show you. So enjoy the rest of this and I will see you guys next time. Bye now. Bye.